Good evening. Thank you for joining us. First at 10 o'clock, an arrest tonight after a stabbing on LSU's campus Wednesday night. 24-year-old Gilbert Fisher is accused of stabbing a man near Highland Road. After that, police say the attacker drove to a convenience store on College Drive where he threatened employees with a knife and even tried to hit them with his car. News News' Alexis Marini spoke to the victim's son. Sylvia Fisher is charged with attempted first-degree murder and hate crimes. I spoke with the stabbing victim's son who says this, he hopes rather, that this sends a message. For LSU freshman Jalen Lands, Wednesday afternoon should have been relaxing. With his first semester over, it was time to rest. As Lands leaves the university gym and walks towards Highland, he stopped in his tracks. And then this guy, he walks past me. And he says something, so I take my uh, headphones out, you know, broad daylight. I'm like, okay, what is he saying? First thing he says is the N-word, and then he pushes me. Lance says he expected a fight. That's when the man pushed him, pulled out a knife, and chased him. Lance, who lives in Baton Rouge, called his dad for help. When his dad shows up, Jalen tells him about the knife. My dad, he, you know, not really listening and stuff, gets too close, and he tries to back up, and he falls and the guy gets on top of him. Police say 24-year-old Gilbert Fisher stabbed Jalen's father in the leg. I had to make a little quick tourniquet because it, it was gushing pretty bad. The attacker got away. He drove to a gas station on Lee Drive, where police say he threw merchandise, called employees racial slurs, and threatened them with the knife. They were able to uh, fend him off with mop brooms and mop handles. Elgin McNeely with BRPD says the man tried to hit the witnesses with his car. He drove away into oncoming traffic. An officer stationed at the Walgreens across the street followed that car with his lights and sirens on, but the driver got away. He later crashed his car on the north part of LSU's campus. Jalen Land says after this experience, he hopes something can be done, especially because Lands believes he was targeted. I'm not one to be like compensation, but it's like, y'all, y'all just letting these people be on campus. Buddy was coming fresh off of campus, you know what I'm saying? And he was just, he found the first person that he saw. According to arrest records, Gilbert Fisher was charged with attempted first degree murder and hate crimes. Those charges are in addition to charges from the gas station incident. I don't know if it's just more security, it's just like, kind of needs to be talked about a little more like we also reached out to LSU police so far we have not heard back good news Jalen says his dad is doing well and is expected to recover